Greetings, Gaming Chads. Welcome back to the Game History series. This is Lisa, returning against my will to cover for Kingpin 64K, who is being held hostage in Guatemala. Today we have a special treat, the newest installment of the Doom series, Doom Eternal. Doom Eternal was developed by Data Design Interactive, also known for their work on the Fucktown series, and released in 2020. These games are well known for featuring the silent badass protagonist, Doom Sergeant. He is best known for going to hell and beating up hell people because he is racist. Doom Sergeant is not exclusive to the Doom franchise, as he also appears in a few other titles, such as Leisure Suit Larry and is also the main character of the Halo game franchise, developed by Konami, where he is known by the name Master Doom Chief Sergeant. Smaller and more obscure appearances from the character also include indie title Cyberpunk 2077, developed by a singular monkey with a typewriter, and Flappy Bird released on the iPhone in 1996. What made Doom as a series so popular and well-beloved? Players can insert themselves into the Doom franchise since Doom Sergeant Master Colonel does not speak. These games, especially the latest release, are very well-made games because they were developed very far away from any Electronic Arts employees. Head developer, Hide Takamiyazaki, was once seen at Electronic Arts headquarters in Redwood City, California, forcibly holding down and farting on several employees. However, since he was rescued from the authorities by Doom Man's voice actor, Donald Glover, and has been hiding out in Australia since, he has not faced any justice for these actions. Since the incident, development of Doom Eternal has been taken over by Nicki Minaj, most recognized for her work on Super Mario Galaxy 4. The employees of Data Design Interactive are happy with her leadership and are very optimistic for the future of the Doom franchise. In fact, some rumors speculate that the next installment of the series will include Family Guy from the famous TV show Peter Griffin featuring Brian Dog. However, only time can tell, and the scheduled release date for Doom Eternal 2 and Knuckles is set for February 2036. Are you hungry for more gamer cummies? We are opening a new Gamer Kumi shop launching today at Kingpin 64K Gamer Kumi Yummy in my tummy bath water gov. Be sure to check it out for a free computer malware available only to the first 25 customers. This has been Lisa, filling in for Kingpin 64K, for another magnificent episode of Gaming History. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, check out my OnlyFans for more exclusive gaming content. Until next time, fucking kill your-